<laughs> Thank you, Speaker. Uh, on behalf of uh, Senator Lillian Dick, I have a question for you, to the government leader in the Senate. Um, just a little bit of preamble. The uh, battered face of Senator, uh, Senator, I'm sorry, of Chief Alan Adam, uh, still very, still very vivid. Uh, it's hard to erase a, a memory of seeing what happened at the hands of the uh, RCMP. And as uh, Senator Dick says, the sad reality is that Indigenous men, like Indigenous women, face a greater risk of being met with violence. Uh, Senator Gold, Minister Blair issued a statement indicating that Indigenous people, Black Canadians and other racialized people far too often experience systemic racism and the desperate outcomes within the criminal justice system. Uh, he also tweeted, we are deeply concerned by the incident in Fort McMurray. People across the country deserve uh, answers. <laughs> Senator Gold, Indigenous people shouldn't have to wait months or years to fix the long-standing problems of systemic racism in the RCMP. Something has to be done now. It is the responsibility of the government to hold the Commissioner, Commissioner Lucky, to account. It is also your responsibility to fix things that are wrong in the workings of the RCMP. What significant concrete and rapid measures will be recommended to implement right now to prevent the increased violence towards and increased incidence of killing of Indigenous people by the police? Well, thank you for your question. Uh, it's deplorable and tragic uh, what continues to happen in this country. And um, it would not be credible for me or any representative of a government or for indeed any citizen to, to pretend, uh, use the prétendre in French, um, that the problems of systemic racism that have plagued us in our history can be solved with one fix or solved in a day or in a week. Uh, it, it, it is, however, uh, uh, the case that the government remains, first of all, that the government recognizes the problem and doesn't shirk away from naming it. Second, that the government is committed uh, to doing what it can to accelerate the pace of change in the institutions within its jurisdiction. And third, the Senate will have an opportunity, thanks to the motion that we passed just a short while ago, uh, to, have, to question ministers, uh, including Minister Blair, on what uh, he uh, uh, intends to do uh, to address this tragic, deplorable, and shameful uh, 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 situation in Canada. Thank you for that. Uh, once again, from Senator Dick, and I recognize that we'll see Minister Blair, I guess, on uh, Thursday. The, um, her question is, though, what is Minister Blair going to do now, right now, to hold Commissioner Lucky to account? What actions will he take now? What managerial or ministerial directives will he issue to her to hold her to account? Senator Gold. Well, I... I uh Senator, thank you for the question. Um, with regard to the commissioner, I think we'll have the opportunity to ask uh, the minister directly within a few short days. He's in the best position to answer what his intentions are. 